Cabinet pulls are great, but so confusing to install. This easy to make jig makes cabinet pull installation a breeze. It consistently spaces all the cabinets and no measuring is required. I bought these brass cabinet pulls to put on my cabinets and now I'm going to make a jig for installing them in a very consistent spacing on the cabinet doors. I'll put a link in the description to this product on Amazon. So I want this one to be three inches from the bottom of the door and one and a quarter inches from the edge of the door and then the mirroring one, it'll be the same. I'll use the same template for all of the cabinet doors because it'll look good if they're all up and over the same amount. So in order to make sure that I have the spacing between these two correct, rather than measuring it every time or even measuring it while I make the jig, I'm gonna use a piece of tape. So what this is going to do is give me an exact distance apart that I need to make these holes based on the piece itself. I put the tape on there like that and then I can take an awl and poke through the spots where I need to drill holes. Now I'll place this piece of tape on my wood and then that will give me the correct spacing. These two pieces of plywood will be my jigs for the left side and right side doors. But first I'm gonna cut off a strip so that I can use that to align them. Now I want to glue these strips that I've just made onto the edges of the template. I'll use just a little bit of glue and clamp it down. And the most important thing here is to make sure that it is flush with the side of the piece. Now I just need to wait for at least 30 minutes for that glue to set up and I can put my template on there. So now what I wanna do is measure the distance from the bottom upward like I did on the cabinet door. And I'll just measure the distance from this spacer here, three inches. And then I also want to measure the distance away from the edge, which is one and a quarter inches. So I need one of them to be right there. I'll take this piece of tape off of my cabinet pull and then I'll line up one of these holes directly on that. And the other one I'll make sure is one and a quarter inch away from the edge. Now I know exactly where I need to drill these two holes and I'll use an awl just to make sure it's more apparent. and I can go ahead and drill these on the drill press. Now I'm going to make sure that this cabinet pole fits on the jig itself to see if the spacing on the screws is correct. That looks like it works, so that means it will also work on the cabinet doors. So because this left side template is the right size, I'm also going to copy this exact template over to the other side by clamping them together and drilling through it. Now that I have two matching templates, 
I can go to the kitchen and start installing the cabinet pulls. Now that I have both of those templates built, all I need to do is clamp them onto the cabinet door and it will align the holes that I'm trying to screw. Now I need to do the same thing with the opposite template on the left side door. And there you have it. This is a very easy way to consistently align your cabinet pulls without having to do a lot of measuring. Now that I have this one done, I just need to do about 25 more and I'll be good to go. Thanks everybody for watching and please like and subscribe. Bye.